Hey y'all, what's up? I had to bring some protection on with us. Hey y'all, welcome to Creative Illuminations. This is the Hard Knock Life for Tarot. We're about to get started with these zodiac energies. Let me see who all up in here before we get started. What's up, lady? What's up, Blue Jeffries? Yes. Give me one second, guys. Let's get started. What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up, Blue Jeffries? What's up, uh, Paponia? What's up, y'all? Had to put some protection around us real quick before we get started. What's up, Carolyn? What's up? What's up, John? All right, so let's get started. So we're finna tap into this energy to see what the universe wants you to know. All right. Y'all say Scorpio. Scorpio may come out. Let's see. Y'all know I let these energies be divinely guided by source. So let's see who's the energy that we're going to be discussing this evening. We got Cancerian energy here. We got Scorpio in the reverse. So we're talking about a karmic Scorpio energy. The truth is about to be illuminated about these particular energies. About a Cancer and about a Scorpio energy. These could be these can be karmic energies. So please take what resonate. Disregard the rest. If it don't apply, let it fly. Welcome new heads. Welcome old heads. Welcome gods and goddesses. Welcome rebel leaders. Welcome to my channel. We're about to bust this energy wide open. If you know you're not in karmic energy, this is not your energy. This could be the karmic who energy I'm pulling on, okay? So please remember to take what resonate and disregard the rest. Let's tap into these messages. These secrets about a karmic Scorpio energy is here. You could be a cancer. You could be the cancer. You could be the secret. If you're a cancer, you're the secret. You could be somebody's secret. Okay. Or there's a secret that's, that, that is about to be told to you. Let's see what's going on. Yeah, somebody. Yeah. Yeah, we are most definitely talking about a water sign here. Go to the sea. Yeah, you need to cleanse your energy from the Scorpio energy. Yeah, you yeah, your ancestors are saying you need a yeah. Yeah, you're the, you're somebody's a, a fake divine masculine here. Yeah. So you was dealing with a fake, a phony, a Scorpio energy. This supposed to have been a divine masculine, but this is not a divine masculine. This is a, a karmic twin flame. Your masculine is not uh uh um uh, in good energy or was not in good energy. Period. Your person could be, you could be the Cancer, he could be the Scorpio. It's two water signs here. Yeah. I feel like somebody's been watching your energy. Yep, Karmic Twin Flame indeed. Yep, Kia. Yep. This person is not for you, but the card is in the reverse. So I feel like in the past you was dealing with a Karmic Twin Flame, and you knew that that person was not right for you at the time. Are you donation-based love? Yes, I am. Yes, Kay. Are you donation-based love? Yeah, I am. I do charge $12.12 .12 for individual readings. Now, I, I don't charge for collective energies, but when it comes to me pulling um, individual readings, I do charge $12.12 .12 if you guys do need that particular energy read. You're welcome, Kay Bradley. I love you. Hey, Brittany. Okay, Cancer Scorpio, okay. But I feel like that this person is wanting to come back towards you. I feel like they may be in good energy and they want to reconcile this relationship with you. Yeah, this person is using their imagination now. He feel like that there's no place like home. Whatever conflict that your person was going through is being released. Yeah, I feel like he's ready to put in work with you. That is it for my Scorpio Cancer energy. Oh, no, it's not. Let me get one more energy. Let me get two more decks and we're going to end it. For this water sign energy. I'm just coming through to just do these two energies real quick. And I'm ending it out of here soon, guys. 55. Thank you guys for the likes, the loves, and the shares. What's up, Risa? He's been stalking me for months. I already know, baby. Yeah, you tuned in just in time. Yes, indeed, baby. Yeah. Yeah, Maya is here. The Divine Mother is here. Yeah, Maya says you're about to, um, you are going through an awakening. Yeah, you're about to be blessed. You're about to experience a new beginning here. 
I am Oya, so I'm coming through to let you know that the daughter of favors, I am the daughter of favors. I'm coming through to let you know that you got blessings coming towards you. And you're going through it. You're coming through an awakening. 13 breakdown of four. And I got four here. This situation will be um, stable here. Yeah, you will be. This situation will be uh, will bring stability. You will have stability being brought to you. The next energy I have is, yes, miracles is on your way. Like I said, you got miracles on your way because you was being an alchemist. Your twin flame energy is here. He was a karmic twin flame, but he is going through some type of healing energy right now. And he wants a reconciliation with you. Let me get one more energy. How much is how much are you doing your reading? It's $12.12 .12 for this particular reading. Yes. And you're about to receive a harvest. Yeah. You could be Brazilian. You could be South American. You could be Argentinian. You could be um you could be from uh Haitian. You could be Jamaican. 17 breaking down to eight. I feel like that you could be a life path number eight. You could be born on the eighth month. Something could be happening for you in eight in eight days or eight weeks. Take it as it resonate. Okay. I don't know, Miss Dre. You have to get your own personal reading. Okay. If you want to know uh, when things is going to um, is going to take place in your life, and to you, Divine C, you can send for this particular reading that I'm reading. It is a three deck for twelve dollars and twelve cents to get the clarity that you need. As soon as I receive the payment on Cash App, then I will most definitely get you your reading. And I will put you in the book of blessings and miracles, okay? Let's get to the next deck. And then we're going to get to the next Zodiac. If no one is not getting the service, I will move to the next Zodiac. And I will end this reading after that, okay? So let's go. This is finishing up for the Scorpio Cancer Energy. Scorpio Cancer Energy. Scorpio Cancer Energy. Uh, it's not a list yet. No one hasn't got on it yet, um, Divine C. You will be the first one. Yeah, I feel like that this masculine does have unconditional love for you. But he was dealing with karmic energies that was doing anything he would say. That's that I do anything you like, masculine. They were trying to keep your masculine stuck, confused, and held down with sexual uh, um, entities here. Okay, show me the cash app again. Okay, it is Starseed1983. If somebody could pin that for me, please. It is Starseed1983. Starseed1983. I'm just going to, yeah, you just enjoying the tea go down to see what's going on in your energy. I feel like that this person does love you. And he is desiring you. But there was a karmic energy that had hidden intentions to keep you guys apart. Yeah, she's going to be going through a bunch of emotions uh, coming and going because this masculine is finally releasing this grip. Thank you, um, Real Tay. You already know, Mob. Let's go, Mob. Mwah. What's up, my love? Yes. So this person was trying to use sex games and tactics to keep your person stuck and confused and to, for them not to move on. But your person is walking away and is um, breathing and is um, getting away from that sex magic is what I'm picking up. All right. So that is September. Not September. Somebody could be born in September here. I don't know what the fuck made me say that. Anyway, let's get to the next energy. Who is my next Zodiac? That is the Scorpio. Yeah, Mercury is here. Mercury returns. So this is the return, the return of the exes. So we're talking about the return of your exes is coming back towards you. You already know, Bob. Let's see. Let's see what they got to say, man. I got one more sign I'm going to do. Yeah, the truth is about to be illuminated here. So that came back out about whatever sign that the universe want me to talk about. So let's see. Who up? Okay, we got a water sign here. So the truth has been illuminated by the water sign, Pisces, Scorpio, Cancer. So we need to do Pisces. Are y'all talking about Pisces? Okay. So we're doing Pisces. Is next. And Virgo is next. Somebody also was dealing with a karmic Aquarius energy. With the, okay. So let's go. I sent the love. Okay, Divine C, I'm going to clear out this energy real quick, and then I'm going to get to you, okay? So the truth has been um, illuminated about an ex of yours that was dealing with a water sign. I'm picking up this is a Pisces energy and a Virgo energy that's in your energy. So let's pull on 
this Pisces energy, and let's see what this Aquarius karmic energy and this Virgo energy has to do with your connection, okay? But this is a Pisces um, element, okay? And the individuals that's involved in this particular reading is a karmic Aquarius and a Virgo energy. That is not the deck. So let's tap in. Thank you so much, Divine. I love you, Ma. Thank you for your donation, too. I appreciate you. Thank you for helping me build um, Creative Illuminations. All donations go towards the building fund so I can start my spiritual um, blessing, uh, my spiritual uh, path in a building. I'm trying to go from the house to a building now. So y'all donations help me out a lot. I love you guys. I thank you for believing in me, believing in the vision, believing in the cause, because we all are here to each one, teach one, reach one, build one. Hey, Wanda, how you doing, baby? So at the bottom of the deck, whoever these karmic energies was, thought they was going to receive a new life and they're not getting it. It's been reversed, period. Yeah. Somebody was trying to co-create a new beginning with someone else and that shit done backfired. Somebody ain't even poised. Somebody ain't grateful. Somebody is unpleasant. Somebody is hard to get along with. Yeah, whoever this person was that was trying to manifest a new life that you supposed to be have or they was trying to take your energy, that shit has backfired on this karmic energy. This could be an Aquarius energy. Yeah, I feel like that you guys are co-creating though. So this person was trying to get pregnant by your person to have a new life. Get the fuck out of here. That's what I got. Co-creating. <laughs> What's up, um, Quan Sholin? What's up, y'all? What's up, Bridget? Give me the energy for the situation. Yeah, I got new life here. Yeah. Yeah, there's a water sign energy. What I tell y'all? Oh, water. Thank you, source. A water sign energy could have been collaborating with Aquarius energy. That's, a, and that's in the reverse. Both of these motherfuckers put, could have been two feminine energies or two masculine, but they was in karmic energy. We're going to put the story together in a minute. Give me a minute. Yeah. Your twin flame is here. Yeah. And he was just not for you at the time. Yeah, this is a collective. I feel like somebody was used to trying to use some type of their imagination here. Hold on. Let me just get all these energies out real quick. Let me see what's going on. Okay. So your twin flame kept taking leaps of faith towards other individuals, co-creating with other individuals for this shit to be blowed up in, in his face. Period. Yeah. He wasn't right for you at the time because he was dealing with other individuals. That's why this situation had to end. Period. But I think, I feel like you on your way to your milk and honey though. Shit. You're on your way to your milk and honey, and you got generational wealth here, period. You don't know, uh, you better get this new life. So your twin flame counted you out, period. Look, that's what you're peeling, but the karmic energy tried to steal your energy. Y'all see what the fuck I pulled in earlier? She wanted your life, but it's attached to you. And if this masculine thought he was going to get it with somebody else, that, no, sadly, be, sadly to be mistaken. Thank you, Free. Hey, Empress. I received sadly, sadly for his mistake that he forfeited his journey and he, and you end up getting his great fortune. You end up getting his goddamn his, his, his abundance because he chose to tap in to deal with karmic energies and didn't choose to build with his divine feminine. You had to walk away because he was co-creating with other individuals. He was co-creating with air sign energy. He was co-creating with the water sign energy period. Yeah, these new leaps of faith that he took, put your masculine, set him, set his ass down, humbled his ass, period. He got a piece of humble pie. Yeah. Like I said, the cars came in the reverse. They will not have a new life. It's been reversed for them, and they will not have any treasure island. It's yours. You work for it. Let's get to the next energy. That's it for that. Yep, give them to everyone but me. Yep. Yep, let's get to the next energy. Where's my next? We got two more decks, and then we're going to end out this um, Zodiac energy. And then I'm going to get in my personal readings. And that will end it out for tonight. 
Thank you so much, Nichols. I love you, baby. Yes. Yeah, the truth is about to be exposed about the situation. If you don't know, now you know. Yeah. People wore a mask. Your masculine wore a mask. They wore a mask. That's why you walked away from these people that no longer served you. Yeah. These individuals wanted you to self-sabotage yourself. Maybe you are part of the occult here. Maybe somebody thought you was a dark witch or something, but you're not. You actually are the truth. You are actually a healer. Period. Thank you guys for the love. I love you guys. The next energy I have is you have sacred lust. You have two masculine energies here that is lusting after you that wants a reconnection with you. So you got two. Some of you got two masculines here. Okay. Yeah. Y'all, some of y'all got two masculines here. One got a beard. Hey, they both ready to fight. I can't show y'all the pictures. I don't want to get blocked. So I'm going to do it like this. I don't want to get blocked. So you have. Yeah, because that picture is like nudity. So you got two um, masculines here, right? One got a weapon. Somebody got then got that Thule. And one got then can fight. <laughs> but they ready to go to war over you. And I feel like they possibly could have both did you wrong. Now they're realizing that you are this special person and they want to um, reconcile with you. Yeah, divine lineage. You are blessed with divine lineage here. Your divine um, counterparts. Oh, look here. Your divine ancestors are protecting you from a auntie energy, a witch energy. Somebody who's a, a tarot card reader, a medium, a high priestess in a reverse air sign energy as you can see the spiders on this car on this card there's there was other minions that was helping her out okay the next energy i have is these secrets have been revealed about this air sign and this water sign about what they were trying to do to this masculine and towards you i feel like that you have surrendered and let let go of control let's get the next deck and let's close out this um pisces energy okay so there's a karmic Pisces and there is a karmic um, Aquarius energy. I feel like this a karmic Aquarius energy is this Virgo energy. She's a fake, what I want to say, leader. She's a fake humanitarian. She's actually, she actually um, lose help. She actually calls people delays, lies. Fake ass medium tarot card reader, somebody who does not divinely guide individuals here. That's who this person is right here, okay? Let's get to the last message. Where's my other deck? Oh, this. What did I do with it? Hold on, y'all. Oh, there you go. Let me put these old eggs together again together. Hold on, give me a second. So we're gonna leave the sun out and we're gonna leave uh, uh, Mercury retrograde out. My holiday, I stayed in my bed all day. My holiday wasn't really the best, but it was cool. I mean, it was the best for me. I was chilling with my ancestors. Shit, I, I, I just, I just chilled, watched me some movies, and you know, made it do what it do. I so I just stayed in my room and just, and just meditated. That's how my, my, my holiday went. So I hope you guys had a good holiday. You too, Empress. Yeah, man. I just got me some much needed rest. So we're going to get a couple more energies and we're going to close out this particular energy. Yeah, Al, you can ask one question. One question is $3.33 and you will send that donation to Starseed1983. Starseed1983. I love you too, Queen Sha. If you guys like my vibe, you can most definitely sign up on my website at creativeilluminations.net. You can become a member for free. When you sign up, you will receive member points. Whenever you get a reading outside of this live session, the member points will go towards half off readings, arts and crafts um, that I make for you guys, as well as my Reiki practitioner healing services. If you guys are interested in, yes, everyone loves your body. I know, right? I love you too, Luna. Yes. Um, <laughs> I love you guys. Y'all are the best. If you guys, y'all know that I'm more than just a tarot card reader. I am also a hypnotherapy, uh, hypno Reiki, uh, therapy, um, practitioner, therapist, uh, practitioner. I am a life coach, a, uh, trauma coach. I am a, hold on guys, life coach, a trauma coach, and I am a business consultant as well. If you need any services, uh, pertaining to any, uh, 
things that you need to get help on, please reach out to me. I am a twin flame trauma healing consultant <laughs> reader. All right, let's get into these messages. I know I seen you, sis. I just gave you your points too. Hold on, y'all. I thought I seen something. Hold on, y'all. Give me a second. All right. Let's go. Let me get some water. Hey, what's up, Sharita? Hey, Mob, I got y'all. I gave you your points too. Y'all, I really don't operate from TikTok when I do my business. I do ask everybody to send to please email me at my website, the home of Creative Illuminations. That's the home site. Also, guys, keep in mind. Also, guys, keep in mind that I also teach spirituality. I teach self, not self-love, but like the, the universal language. It's called the divine in me. The universally, the universally aligned misfits is the name of the school. The name of the program is the edu what is it called? The educational developmental cognitive regenerational school of the arts. And there I teach Kabbal Kabbalan Kabbalion. I teach uh the 12 laws of the universe. I teach um the Rosen Crucian um ways of teachings. I teach um astrology and birth charts. So it's much more. I'm just giving you guys just a quick breakdown of what I teach with the Reiki. I can heal you through if okay, so with Reiki. I use that energy to heal you energetically by clearing out your chakras, uh, by unleashing any negative stagnant energy from trauma that you have dealt with in your life, whether this is spiritual, mental, physically, verbal, or emotional. If you guys need help healing that as well as diseases, um, autoimmune efficiencies, HIV, um, syphilis, STDs, STIs, um, vertigo, um, allergies, sleep problems, um, divorces, grief, um, a lot of things. If you know any health problems that you guys are in, I do have the energy, not me, but God has gave me the ability and the energy from the Holy Spirit to help heal you guys. So if you guys need to be healed, in any sort of way, I'm here for you. I am on a double mission and I'm always here to guide you, to help you, to heal you as you begin to release any negative patterns in your life. We birth leaders here at Creative Illuminations. You are a leader. Uh, I know I'm not for everyone, but that's okay because I'm only here to attract leaders and that's it. Leaders that's going to help us uh, change the trajectory of this negative energy into seed a new way in life. So thank you guys for listening to that announcement. Let's continue with the message. Yeah, whoever your person was dealing with, she was very poisonous. She came in reverse. So he's kicking her out the energy. He found out a baby wasn't his. Yes, you're for me, sis. Thank you, Luna. I love you. Yeah, so somebody was faking a prison um, amazing announcement. Thank you, Free. Mwah. I love you, my darling. Y'all, this is my last week doing announcements because y'all know I start school classes um, for the collective. These are free collective classes that will start January 4th, 2023 on Facebook. Those classes is, um, is about learning about the astrology. We're going to start with the foundation first. And the foundation is going to start with learning the zodiac. And then we're going to break it on down, okay? So if you guys would like to join me for the metaphysical classes, divination classes, please come over to Facebook to sign up. Well, I got to use the bathroom. <laughs> My damn password, your payment, I'm subscribing. Okay, Empress, thank you. Thank you. So come on over to Facebook. I, I promise you guys it's going to be a hell of a lesson. It is spelled R A. S-H-U-N-R-A-S-H-U-N. 
was that she was faking a, a news business venture to get him to put money in it. Yeah. So R-A-S-H-U-N is that Facebook page. And we're going to, like I said, we're going to start with that astrology. We're going to learn about um, the different personalities, the, the good aspects, the negative aspects. We're going to pick up if they're mutable, if they're stable. We're going to pick up, we're going we're gonna to learn everything that you could possibly learn about astrology and about the zodiacs and about the trajectory of reading the planets. Also about um, applying the Albert Einstein theory, the laws of relativity, learning about how to tap into the past, the future, and uh, the near future energy, okay? Past, future, past, current, and near future energy. So it's going to be free. Yeah, that's free. The only time that I charge is if I have to do individual readings. That's it. So if you want a personalized session, then that's a different story. But when, I, when I'm doing a collective like this, I'm, this ain't number free energy. Then I'm, I'm teaching to the collective. Starting Jan, Jan, July, June 4th. Not June. Why the fuck I keep saying June and July? Somebody must be a Cancer and a Gemini. Uh, uh, that, that's in my energy. I meant to say January 4th, okay? So I hope to see you guys there. All right? Remember to come to... And, and if you... And, if, and like I said, you can uh, spell it again. R-A-S-H-U-N. R-A-S-H-U-N. I'm going to pull this energy real quick and I got to use the bathroom, guys, and I'll be right back. Yeah, there's no commitment. So your person took this commitment back. Your person wished they never met this person at all. Yeah, he did start a family with this person or this was a baby mama of some sort. Or yeah, this divine masculine took away his king's phallic because he don't want to be with that person anymore. He found out that she was a piece of trash and she was not his soulmate. Yeah, yeah. I feel like he's been sending you telepathic songs, music, and dreams because he wants to reconcile back with you. Yeah. Yeah, there's someone else. I feel like there's someone else in Divine Feminine. I feel like he... He want to be with you. There's someone else. If you look at the card, this is the karmic energy he's with, but he's thinking about you. So... One of the reasons why he's cutting this energy off because he's thinking about you and you are that someone else for him. Yeah, he wants you to show your wild side, but you're not because you're not going to just give it to him that easy. You're going to put your boundaries up or she, y'all know how I talk, okay? You are a divine feminine who I'm talking to. So you're not going for the bullshit. Yeah, I feel like he's been sending you mixed signals. Maybe at one time he was sending you mixed signals and one time he was like, um, he wanted you and then at other times he didn't want you. He would block you off, you know, stop talking to you. And then sometimes he'll call you and talk to you. Yeah. And that's why you cut his ass off because he kept sending you mixed signals. Period. Let me get one more energy. Yeah. Yeah. This karmic who had hidden attentions to try to get this masculine to, to make him stay with her. That shit backfired. Yeah, because this masculine really do love you. He just hid his, his feelings from you, period. Yeah, this is a collective. I feel like this karmic energy is going through a bunch of emotions because he's coming to bring you love, and he also want to take you on a vacation, period. Yeah, you guys are ascending. Yeah, baby. Yeah, and this fake energy is getting uh, energy red, or she's, she made a fake Facebook or Instagram or YouTube page to get you uh, to to see what's going on with your energy or with your masculine energy. He is running away from this karmic energy. Yeah, somebody who likes to dress sexy, maybe a stripper. You know, yeah, Archangel Michael is protecting you from this person. Yeah, something could have happened today. I'm not going to read all this. Yes, I will. They want me to. Yeah, you just enjoying the tea go down. He's desiring you. She tried to uh, keep a grip on him. With sex magic. Yeah, she wants retaliation. She's not plugged in. Yeah, she was just a love affair. Yeah, she got receipts that she want to tell you about this masculine. Because he don't want to make her scream. She wants to uh, reveal a secret about him. Yeah, who is it? A drama queen? Yeah. I feel like she's obsessed with your energy. She's going through a bunch of emotions right now. Yeah, this was a tragic love affair your masculine was in. 
Yeah, he was about helping individuals that didn't want to help themselves. He don't want he doesn't want romantic sex with her. Yeah, she was just somebody who liked to do it in public, do it in cars. She had no self love, uh, self love or uh, self pres pre uh, pres preservance about herself. This is your twin flame I'm talking about. Yeah, at first he wasn't open. Now he is open. Yeah, at first he was pissed off with you for whatever reason, but I feel like he's he has healed from whatever that that hate was or he was pissed off about he has healed from that i feel like this situation we'll have a happy outcome yeah i feel like that he got his he got this energy that's gonna be chasing after him though all right so as he running away he go to karmic energy chasing right after his ass she got them running right after his ass and he running away from my ass yeah because he has no magnetic, magnetic pull towards her. It's over with. Yeah. He wants you to open a relationship when he comes around. And he knows that you are his soulmate. His twin flame. He know that he you are that you guys have a spiritual union. He know that you guys got a soul contract. Let's go. And this karmic can't handle the truth that he wants to meet up with you. That's your energy. We're done with collective energies. A shade, namaste, amen. Now we're about to get into individual readings. Thank you guys. Give me one second as I clear this energy out. Thank you guys. He needs to. He doesn't, yeah, I know. Other than that, I'm not stupid. I know that's right, Empress. What I do? Since I heard you say June, well, June 4th, what I do? I don't know what made me say that, sis. It just came out blah. <laughs> I meant to say January 4th. I don't know what the hell. <laughs> I feel like maybe mm, this this situation may be similar to what you're going through, sis. But I'm gonna get I got a couple people that sent the donations, so I'm gonna get these donations out the way. I love you, sis. I love y'all. You're awesome. Thank you, Diana. I love you. That's my that's your B day, sis. Damn. So this message was for you, Ma. So you came right on time. You know if I said your birthday, this message was for you, right? That was your message, baby. Free game. You got it. Free game. You got it, mom. <laughs> you got it. If you resonate with that message, I said your birthday and I said those months, then that message resonate with you. That message is meant for you to read. And here was for you. Let's go. Let me, um, I wish I knew how to send your money for a reading. Hit my situation very close. Yeah, uh, you have to send the donation to Starseed1983, Cash App, Cash App, Starseed1983. I accept also payments through Facebook Messenger. So if you guys got Facebook Messenger, I can uh, send that payment to you and you can send it to me. All right. I really don't use anything else but Venmo. And if you like to, if you guys got Venmo, then you can send it to at Creative Illuminations, Creative underscore Illuminations. All right. Shit didn't hear it out. Shit didn't hear it at all. Damn, sis. Thank you, free. Well, let me get to these next. Uh, let me get to the patrons that paid. Give me a second. I need some water. What's up, Sandra? Baby, you know, we, I got you, baby. <clears throat> oh, excuse me. Let me get my um, book. Let me get y'all into the book of blessings. Let's get it. Uh-oh. Let me get my handy-dandy notebook. We're searching for blues clues. Well, at your four blues clues. Uh, at your four blues clues. Uh, uh, uh. I don't know why I got that song. Yeah, we blues clues, all right. We investigate like a motherfucker. <laughs> I got that blues. Yeah, I remember blues clues. <laughs> they used to come on Nickelodeon. That used to be that shit, though. I used to like that show.
Who is Queen Anna? Who is Queen Anna? Is Queen Anna here? Yeah, it's the male. I want the one. Yeah. <laughs> Tell him. I'm finna, I think this Queen Anne person, I'm finna send her money back to her if she's not popping up. Is Queen here? Okay, so this person is not here. It's, it's at creative underscore illuminations. I-L-L-U-M-I-N-A-T-I-O-N-S. Illuminations. So I feel like that whoever this person was, Queen Anna, she said she lost my life. So I'm going to refund her money back to her. You silly. You silly, Jay. <laughs> so let me refund her money back to her and we good on that. I'm trying to see one more time. Queen. Queen Anna, are you here? No, you're not. So I'm going to pay her money back. You got $5. All right, so she got her $5 back. So, guys, if don't nobody else want a reading, I will be ending out this live. Thank you guys for joining. I love you guys. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I will check. Let me check my Venmo before I leave. I will get y'all one advice card, and I'm out of here. I love you guys. Y'all already know what time it is. But well, somebody just sent the payment, I think. Okay, so like I said, you can send the payment to my Venmo, the Venmo. I'm going to write it down for you. I can see it right here. Like I said, if you don't have Cash App, I do have Venmo. And my Venmo, just to let you know. Woohoo. Let me go back into settings. Yeah, like I said, if you have Venmo, it's creative and illuminations. I-L-L-U-M-I-N-A-T-I-O-N-S. You should be able to get it. If not, baby, I don't know what to tell you about, you know, how you can get to the readings. I'm giving you all the information that you need for you to send your payment. Why do mostly all black readers say the same thing, but with right readers don't? Just curious. I don't know what you're talking about, uh, Tiffany. You're, you're losing me. I don't know <laughs> what you're referring to, my love. How the ancestors. I don't know, baby. I can't. I don't know. I can't answer that for you. <laughs> Why do uh, mostly our readers say the same thing? I don't know. I, I, I can't answer that. I'm not like everybody else. Okay? So I, I, I don't know. <laughs> Honestly. <laughs> All right. So I guess that's it, baby. Y'all. No, you're not. Yeah, I'm not like everybody else. You know, you know, people like to group us into making it seem like that we are the same and we're not. That's just like me saying that every guy, um, every Asian is the same or every Caucasian is the same when we're not. Everybody different and do different to, do, do different things in different ways. We may look alike and we may sound alike, but we're not alike. I'm so excited too, Luna. I'm so, yes. Yeah. <laughs> I swear that racial shit need to be over with by now. I'm tired of that shit. I'm so tired of the race card. It needs to be over with because it's not about race. It's about energy. What people realize, I could care less about your skin color. It, what, I, what, 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 what makes me turn away from you is your energy. If you're karmic and nasty. Thank you so much, Kwanisha. I'm so sick of it. I'm so sick of it. And yeah. Yeah, you already know, Ma. You already know. Three, yeah, yeah, child, I'm finna get up out of here. I done already did that reading. I'm about to put it on YouTube though. Wait, what? I missed the read. He gonna 
and do that again. <laughs> I'm going to put this up on YouTube, though, man. I'm just coming through to see if anybody needs a private reading, a personal reading before I leave. You're welcome, um, Koshan. I'm over here saying your name wrong. You know my ass. <laughs> yeah, they came to disturb the energy. And what we do is we eradicate it. We send it right back to sender. I don't mind talking to them. But we're going to have an educated discussion here. It's, it's fine. I'm open to all dialect. See, that's what you can do when you can heal and you don't come from an angry or a resentful place in life. I'm not worried about what the hell happened in history, but I'm trying to work, I'll worry about now is what the fuck, how, what we can do now to move forward in life. How can we become a po positive, impactful uh, people towards all people? I'm tired of the race car. No more race. I want my blacks, my browns, my purples, my oranges, my golds to come together. It's not about color. It's about energy, period, because we're balanced. We're here to see the way. I need all my sisters and brothers from all creeds and nationalities and religions. It doesn't matter. I need all y'all <laughs> for real, straight up. Man, we are, we are not a biased company at all. It's create no it the the cash app is starseed1983 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 heck your family ain't even your family if you think about it hell it, your family will throw you under the bus quicker than anybody else will so that let you know energy is very real yes what do I do when I get my money for a reading how do I find you queen you can reach me at creativeilluminations.net on my website what you do is come to the website and you um, subscribe. You can subscribe. You subscribe for free. And whenever you get your reading, you can book with me on the website and send the ca cash app uh, payment there. You can send payment through cash app after you book or you could just write me a message and then we could just set it, set it up. But I need you to get in contact with me, though. Um, either you can send me a message on TikTok, but I prefer that you come to creativeilluminations.net. Thank you, Christine Miller. Um, to set your, to talk to me personally, because that's where I operate from. I love the ice cream, Christine. So guys, I'm going to go ahead and end the live. If nobody else did, did not want that, re get their personal reading done. For real, they ain't though. They ain't though. I'm going to wait a couple more minutes. 33 Christ Conscious, 88. You're about to have a new, you're about to have a fortunate breakthrough, baby. Let's go. And my phone just went off. Somebody just uh, did a cash app, so I will now. Have a good night, spirit. I think somebody just sent a cash app, so I will do that reading. Oh, thank you so much, my love. Thank you so much, um, uh, Elf Hire. Thank you. I love you. I appreciate you. Thank you. I'm going to go ahead and end out then. Um, I think that's all the energy. I will be back here same time tomorrow. No, you didn't offend me. But no, sis, I didn't take you as a defense, Tiffany, just to let you know. I didn't take you as a defense. But it's a situation that needs to be aroused. You know, we need to talk about it. Because this is that energy in the room. I'm a person of color. Okay, Tiffany, no. What I'm, what I'm getting at is... That this has to happen. You came through right with the perfect, uh, what I want to say, scenario for me to address this situation, right? So I feel like it's been the, the pink elephant in the room that we need to heal and not be stuck on cognitive dissonance. Like I didn't take you, I didn't pick that up from your energy at all. But it was a way to bring, op to open a conversation that needs to be open. That makes sense. I think it's time for us to be real about the situation and, and, and find the soulless that we need to heal the cognitive dissonance that we have been raised in our environment. It's time to address these situations regardless what creed nature that you're in. Okay? So I hope no one take offense of what I said, but what I was doing was making a point. You know, why we should come together and how we can, how individuals 
how they try to differentiate us when we're not different. We all the same. We all bleed through similar veins. Sister, brother, you are my reflection. So why is it that uh, it seems like that we're separated when we're really not because we're made in God's image? So you made a, you made a perfect dialect, Tiffany. When you came through with them, told those two questions, and I appreciate you for that, because now we can open the door for more conversations like this. And I love you for that, sister. Thank you. I appreciate you. I really do. That's this is what I'm talking about. We we feed off of each other. You feel me? So, yeah. And ain't no black or white people. We are all sh uh, shades of brown. Period. Exactly, Renee. Thank you. Ch tell them. Tell them. <laughs> Tell the truth, Renee. And ain't no black or white people. We all shades of brown, period. And we are. It's just that pigmentations is higher than others. I'm telling you, we are the same. That, that'd be in class, though. See, you got to learn about that star seed system you come from, baby. Hey, we tapped in over here. I'm just saying, though. <laughs> this video will be uploaded on um, YouTube. When it's done processing, guys, I love you guys. I hope to hear from you soon. I will be back tomorrow for two more Zodiacs. Y'all already know how we get down. I love you. Let me make sure someone didn't send a cash out first. 44, your situation is about to be stable. I just want to make sure that no one else sent, and then we're going to end it. I'm almost transparent. I'm going, I know, right? Hey, translucent baby. We we looking like water flowing through. Look at here. Translucent baby. Yeah. So no one has to sit the donation. So guys, I'll see you later. Bye. Good night. Love you. I said nothing but healing energy your way. Diamonds up. Crowns on. We are healed over here. We birth leaders over here. Let's get it started. I love you guys. Remember to stay sucker free and I'll talk to you soon. Have a good night.